Sandy Williams is buckled up and ready for action. It looks and feels like she's part of a video game, but it's actually high-tech rehab for her Parkinson's disease. We know in neurorehabilitation, you have to challenge patients for them to get better. And so this provides a very safe environment for that to occur. The virtual reality treadmill has two belts, one for each foot, and a base that moves to mimic different surfaces. It can also react and adjust to a patient's movement, and a wraparound video screen completely immerses the patient into a real-life scenario. When I go over like a little hill, you feel it in the machine. Rather than just having the patient walk or an individual walk up and down uh, you know, a standard biomechanical track, now what we can do is we can change the uh, environment in a very dynamic fashion. Special programs are designed to work on specific skill sets while providing positive feedback. During weekly appointments at Cleveland Clinic, Sandy works with her therapist on gait and increasing stride length by touching her toe to a box. Other times she's asked to target birds and butterflies while walking. This helps with balance and it satisfies that competitive spirit. I enjoy doing the birds and the butterflies and swatting them down and killing them. Uh, not that I enjoy the killing part, but I do enjoy the challenge of can I get them? I know once I slow down, it could come to the point where I couldn't move. So I'm willing to do whatever I can to keep myself going. At Cleveland Clinic, I'm Erica Foreman.